What is up, YouTube? This is Son of a Booth here. On uh, this video, um, this, I'm gonna be doing a short rant called The Capcom Rant. Now, uh, this will be my first rant on this channel. Um, also, this is gonna be the first rant, uh, which is a video game related matter. Now, usually on this channel, I cover uh, comedic content, but uh, for this, for this uh, rant here, it's um, it's personal to me because this is about Capcom. Capcom! Um, back uh, back in the 1990s, early 2000s, where um, the company has made a awesome impact in my life uh, with their unique, stellar variety of uh, fighting games and also um, other games that uh, from existing franchises that today they haven't been using very much. Where's Title Crisis? Where's Rival Schools? Where's Power Stone? Where are they Capcom? Where are they? I know you're hiding them Capcom. I know you're hiding them Capcom. Now, over the last few weeks, um, I have seen a couple of Capcom related stuff. Um, one of them being a Twitter post um, about a beloved fighting video game franchise that I really love so much that was on the Sega Dreamcast called Power Stone. Now, I really love this game because um, it, not only was it 3D arena, well, not only was it a 3D style arena game, but um, it was similar to Super Smash Brothers and it had this popular mechanic, well, not popular, but unique fighting mechanic um, that allowed you to transform into superhuman beings with super human abilities with the power of three power stones. Now, um, ever since um, the release of Power Stone 2, um, there has been a third installment, and this leads me to the question. Where's, Where's Power Stone 3? I know you're hiding it, Capcom! Quit hiding it! Where's Power Stone 3? I'm losing my freaking mind here, Capcom! <laughs> Now, Capcom, if you're listening or watching this video here, I uh, know you've been making a comeback these last few years. From the release of Monster Hunter World to Devil May Cry 5, but I still have one major concern. Um, it seems that you haven't been using your other franchises. Dog Stalkers, Captain Commando, Bionic Commando! Definitely sure, there's plenty of existing franchises that you haven't been reconsidering using. Final Fight! Mega Man Legends! Breath of Fire! To make new games. Now, I guarantee you, Capcom, if you, let's say for example, make a new Power Stone, make like a, a compilation of both Power Stone 1 and 2, or make a compilation of Dino Crisis 1 and 2. And a new game? I guarantee you, you'll make good profits off of this. You like money, don't you, Capcom? Yes, we love money! Then start making new games from your existing franchises. And for God's sakes, don't cut out the content! We'll do as you command. What I'm trying to say is you, you gotta use your other existing franchises here. Because if you don't, people, people are just gonna think that you're just about Devil May Cry and Resident Evil and Monster Hunter only, but you have so many other franchises. You have an amazing library full of existing franchises here that you can make new games of. You're really missing an opportunity here. So, just from a just from a, a big Capcom fan here, <clears throat> excuse me, a big Capcom fan here, if you use your other franchises and give them the same treatment you give to Devil May Cry 5 and Resident Evil 3 Remake, I guarantee you, you'll make 
more profit than you can even handle. So, Capcom, please, do me one favor. Use your existing franchises. I want rival skulls! I want it! I want it! <laughs> I want it, Capcom! Listen to your fans, Capcom! Your fans are going crazy for other new games based off your existing franchises, Capcom! Do it for the fans, Capcom! <laughs> hey, if you like this video, hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel so you can see more comedic content from yours truly. Alright, have a good one.